out here. Brandon gonna go. Brandon goes left-handed. Brandon's a right-handed guy. Goes left-handed. Immediately over. Whereas Jake is gonna be chilling in that back center. Yep. Brandon Cornell. So Brandon Cornell feeling comfortable in the Doritos. He's a Dorito side player, looking like he wants to push that way. But again, with his offhand, but that's just how comfortable he is left-handed. He's been playing it all weekend long. Both these guys going left-handed into the Drew too. Oh, and Jacob Edwards dropped the coast-to-coast -coast shot. First time since in about 10 years. Wow. The Tampa Bay damage has put a win on guys. the board. And it's going to be Jacob Edwards. Unbelievable performance the entire tournament long. Coming out of the bracket of death is the... In the pits, the big celebration from a triumphant Tampa Bay damage. They've been waiting so long. It's been such a troubled road for them. Last year, they missed Sunday twice, taking 11th place, just on the cusp of making it to paintball's most important day. But they reformed the team, and Coach Joey Blute had faith in his men. He had faith in his entire roster. Everyone got spins out there, and it came all the way down. Again, fighting through the bracket of death, they had to get through Dynasty, Infamous, Diesel, X Factor, and then they matched up again with Infamous in the quarters. That was a close one point match. They pretty much murdered Energy Elite, one of the big stories in the tournament who murdered Aftermath to get to the semifinals. And then they match up against Impact. They go all the way through regulation, all the way through overtime. Smith couldn't get it done. They sent Jacob Edwards out there, who is, you know, he's had a, an interesting and amazing pro career, but he is the hero of the day. Congratulations, you can see there on your screen. Tampa Bay is back at the top here again. We got ourselves a very interesting pro paintball year here, Rich. Your thoughts? Uh, congratulations, Tampa Bay Damage. Well deserved. It's been a long time and I'm super happy for them and super happy for CJ. He never gave up uh, hope or faith. Kept supporting them, kept supporting Joey and and I believe in that team. That's a great, great win for them and that's going to carry them through maybe, you know, a season or two, right? feels amazing for those guys and impact nothing to be ashamed of played a great